guys welcome back to my channel today I have another coach review video I showed this purse before in my what I got for Christmas video which I'll link up here for you guys so you can check that out in case you didn't watch it I do want to thank hey lady for letting me know the name of this bag and I was able to look it up for you guys when I was gifted the purse I didn't know the style of the purse but it is the gallery tote bag and this bag is so ginormous that it doesn't fit in the shot it's bigger than my head as you can see this bag is from the coach outlet and they still have it in stock and they have multiple colors so I suggest you go ahead and check that out I'm gonna go ahead and leave the link down in the description so you can check out all the colors to be honest I would not normally gravitate toward this bag I don't even remember seeing it online or maybe I did see it online but it didn't attract my attention as you guys already know I don't like really big bags I usually gravitate towards the medium to small size and I do have a few larger bags including my Tyler carry on but I used that bag specifically for work but once I had that bag in my collection I didn't really think about getting another big bag because I just don't really use them as much when I received this bag I initially thought wow that's a really big bag I didn't think I was gonna use it as much as I do this tote is the black cross grain leather and it has the gold detailing usually I'm not a gold detailing kind of person but lately I've been kind of getting into it a little bit at a time as you can see I'm wearing my gold coach earrings that I also got for Christmas I actually have been really enjoying this bag and I've been using it non-stop since Christmas and I just love this bag obviously a lot of things fit it's ginormous so should I even show you what fits in the bag because everything fits in this bag it's just such a comfortable bag I thought it was gonna be bulky because I did have a tote before I don't remember the specific style I ended up selling that tote because I didn't use it as much and it just didn't feel comfortable using it on my shoulder but that is not the case with this one this bag has a zipper right in the front which I don't really use oh I have a dollar so I guess I use it sometimes to put my cash and I have the paper stuffing it's pretty spacious you can fit your phone and you still have a lot of room for other items the bag does have a zipper so you can close the bag and not lose anything the inside is very spacious and the zipper opens pretty much all the way so the opening is large I do have a 13 inch little travel size laptop and I know that one for sure fits in here the inside is pretty open I do have two little compartments here so they're like the credit card kind of slots and right now I have my glasses in there it also has another zipper opening here and this zipper is pretty spacious is big currently I just have my keys there and then my little wallet of course it has the coach leather tag in here and I just like how it's so roomy it goes both ways with a bag like this that doesn't have a lot of compartments or different separations like the Tyler does you might put a lot of items in there and it might be a little bit hard to find versus other bags that have compartments you can kind of divide everything and know where you're putting everything and with this one you kind of have to dig through and find it but since it does have a really large opening I don't feel like I have an issue finding my things everything's just kind of there since I've been carrying this larger bag to work I feel like I take more things to work than I usually would one of them being now I carry a brush because it fits in my bag <laughs> I've been carrying my aftershocks and I just uh, know that they're not gonna get squished or anything they're just a lot of room I just have my essentials that I always tell you guys my sunglasses I have uh, you know my keys I also have two types of lotions since of course it fits now I can carry more so I have my gold bond lotion and then I have my hard as huff nail lotion I also have my bag in a bag that I always show you I always get questions on this bag and where I bought it the name of it and all that but I got this at the dollar store it's just a really basic clear plastic bag and I wanted to get something like this so like that I can put my cuticle oil and perfume eye drops and just other things that if they leak they leak inside this plastic bag and not in my really luxurious nice bag the bag itself is pretty lightweight even with all my items in there it's not that heavy the handle is around 10 inches since the top is kind of tapered in I don't know if you can see the kind of a uh, triangle shape so since it's tapered in it's flat here 
I can squeeze it under my armpit and it doesn't feel uncomfortable and I don't feel like I'm misshaping the bag because the bag already has kind of like a flat, flexible kind of shape. I really like this bag. I've been using it a lot and I just really enjoy it. I don't think I have any marks just yet and I hope it stays like this. It's pretty clean and I just love this bag. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how this bag looks and how it sits on my body. This bag is pretty simple, so I did think about putting a scarf for kind of dressing it up. And I tried using a tule, I think that's what it's called, a scarf, which are the skinnier, longer ones. And I couldn't get a nice bow, it kind of looked kind of weird, so I didn't end up putting that one. I ended up trying a diamond scarf, and that didn't work out. So what I'm thinking, I might get some sort of keychain and maybe hook it up to one of the rings here. And I think that will give it a little extra something. So it's not um, super simple, but even with the simple look, it's just such a classic, simple bag that you can use everywhere and take anywhere. So even without dressing it up, I think it looks amazing. This bag retails for $131. Like I said, check out the link below so you can see if this is the right bag for you. So is this bag worth it or not? It is worth it. <laughs> I was shocked that I liked it as much as I do. I wouldn't usually gravitate to a large bag like this, but I use it a lot and I really enjoy it. And I would recommend this bag. If you don't mind carrying this big bag and you need something for work or you just carry a lot of things because you have kids or whatever the case may be, this is the bag for you. It's really lightweight, it's pretty classic, and it's not too expensive. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any future videos. And I'll catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.